Hey loves, welcome to my channel. My name is Gracie Popio, and today's video will be talking about the skincare products that I use during my acne treatment. If you want to know the products that I use during my Accutane treatment, please keep on watching. The first thing I use is the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser, which is intended for normal to dry skin. It cleanses, hydrates, and helps restore the protective skin barrier with three essential ceramides and hyaluronic acid. It also claims to balance the moisture of your skin. It's very gentle on the skin, non-drying, non-irritating, non-commodogenic, won't clog pores, and it's fragrance-free. Um, I got mine from iHerb, and this retails for 6 dirhams and 44 fills. But the thing is, I always check for promotions and then place my order. So after discount, I only paid 45 dirhams and 57 fills. Abang, abang lang kayo ng promotion sa iHerb, guys, so you get a bigger bang for your buck. Very important yung sunscreen when you are taking Accutane as your skin is very sensitive to the sun. I used to use the COSRX Aloe Soothing Sun Cream. However, this is apparently discontinued. I used to like it because it's very light on the skin. So when I ran out of this one, I used the Garnier Sun Cream which I got for Tender Hams from lookfantastic.ae when they had a sale. The retail price is 47 dirhams and 80 fills. But this one is a little heavy on the skin, so I don't recommend this, especially for oily skin people. I am currently using the Hamish Artless Glow Base, which I didn't like at first. There, there were tiny specks on my face when I used it, but now it is gone. I interchanged this with Vior Aqua Rich Watery Essence, which I got recently from Beauty MNL at 488 pesos. This reminds me of the COSRX because it's also light on the skin that I was able to apply this on my husband's uh, face. For PM skincare, I enjoyed using the Manila Co. Clean It Zero. This claims to melt makeup, exfoliate, and hydrate in one simple step. I used to have glass skin after using this. However, that was when I had dry skin. This is actually expensive at 72 dirhams 0.19 fills. So I'm now interchanging this with the Hamish All Clean Balm, which only cost 56 dirhams 0.76 fills. But I only paid 51 dirhams after discount. Also note that Vanilla Co. has only 100 ml, whereas the Hamish Balm is 120 ml. I then use the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser to double cleanse my face. For toner, I use the Thayer's Witch Hazel Rose Petal. This is gentle on the skin and it was what I have at that time so I was only trying to empty the bottle. This claims to add moisture while protecting the skin and add a natural healthy glow while tightening the pores and smoothing the skin without drying. This is a huge bottle containing 355 ml of product for 35 dirhams. I only pay 29 dirhams after discount. Next step is the Ordinary 100% Organic Cold Pressed Argan Oil. This oil is rich in fatty acid, vitamins, and carotenes which hydrates and nourishes the skin. You can also use this on the hair which will leave your hair shiny but don't put too much because otherwise your hair will be a greasy mess. This oil is rich in vitamin E to combat dryness and my skin will be very well hydrated in the morning whenever I apply this at night. This retails for 36 dirhams from lookfantastic.ae. I paid 21 dirhams after discount. My last step in the evening is the Ordinary Natural Moisturizing Factors plus HA. This has hyaluronic acid which should help retain the moisture in the skin. This is lightweight on the skin and does not feel sticky when applied. I only paid 24 dirhams for 100 ml worth of product. This retails for 41 dirhams in lookfantastic.ae. I will put the link on the description box below for all the products that I'm mentioning in this video. To combat the dry skin, I use Dove Soap, which is very mild on the skin, and we all know what this is. To moisturize the body, I apply Lubriderm Advanced Therapy Lotion, Deeply Hydrates Extra Dry Skin. This retails for 42 dirhams, and I paid 40 dirhams after discount. 
The good thing about this is it has 709 ml of product, so it took me a while to finish the bottle. It's not sticky on the skin, so I really liked it. I also like the Mediheal NMF Aquaring Ampule Mask to pamper my skin. This claims to enhance skin elasticity and give the tightening effect. This retails for 55 dirhams, but I paid 44 dirhams after discount for 10 Yay! sheets, so not bad. Aside from the skin, I also had dry lips and dry eyes. So for the lips, I used the Aqua 4 Healing Ointment. I can't leave the house without this. This is such a huge tube. So even after this date, I still have this product. As in, sobrang yung pagka-dry ng lips. I would have cracks on my lips if I don't apply this. So this retails for 20 dirhams and I paid 18 dirhams. For the eyes, I use Visine Dry Eye Relief Lubricant Eye Drops. This is 15 ml, which is a little excessive. So let's talk about supplements. I started taking two capsules of natural milk thistle to support my liver as Accutane is a very strong medicine. This is 26 dirhams for 60 capsules and I pay 24 dirhams after discount. After finishing a bottle of natural, I started taking California Gold Nutrition Silymarine Complex Liver Health Milk Thistle, which has more ingredients and this has eye tested logo, so I assume this is better. I only need to take one capsule daily with food. I paid 53 dirhams for 120 veggie capsules. The retail price of this is 56 dirhams. Because the medicine seems to be affecting my cholesterol, I started taking Omega-3 by the California Gold Nutrition, which is also eye-tested. I had a hard time swallowing this because the soft gel is too big. I take two soft gels daily. This claims to support overall health and well-being as well as helps to maintain optimal lipid profile. I paid 46 dirhams for 240 soft gels. The retail price is 48 dirhams. Prevention is better than cure, so I also took vitamin E, one soft gel daily. My cousins and I placed this order from Desert Cart. This costs 88 dirhams for 500 soft gels. The last supplement is the NeoCell Super Collagen Plus C, type 1 and 3. This should help support healthy collagen formation throughout the body. I take 6 tablets on an empty stomach daily. This retails for 80 dirhams, but I only paid 65 dirhams. I have actually started using the Ordinary Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution on the fourth month of my treatment. This seems to be a dupe for the Pixie Glow Tonic. Um, this claims to resurface and revitalize skin with Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution. This is an alpha hydroxyl acid that gently exfoliates the surface layer to restore clarity and visibly improve uneven textures. This is 240 ml guys, which would last you for a long time since you only need to use it once a day. This retails for 41 dirhams and I seem to get a good promotion and paid only 24 dirhams. I let my skin rest before applying the next product which is the Ordinary Lactic Acid 5% plus HA 2% Superficial Peeling Formulation. Medyo overkill na ako sa AHA products uh, but I won't probably repurchase this again. And just stick with the glycolic toner. This mildly peels the skin to gently exfoliate the surface layer of skin with lactic acid to create a more even and refined texture. So these two products should help remove the acne scars from my skin. Alright, so I think that is it for me. That's it for now. Um, let me know if you have any suggestions or comments kung ano man yung mga future videos na gusto, gusto nyong gawin ko. And um, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. Um, I would appreciate your support. So hopefully I'll see you again on my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!